And being a young mom, you're walking around in the summer and wearing shorts and everybody's staring at your legs and judging you. It's a four hour job to start covering up cutting scars. Taylor Freeman is getting a tattoo to cover up scars dating from her teenage years. And she's not alone. This tattoo artist is offering the service for free. Like I suffered from horrible, horrible depression as a teenager. And you know, a bunch of horrible, horrible relationships. Steve P says when construction slowed down business at his shop on Calgary's 17th Avenue Entertainment District, he started a contest to cover up the city's worst tattoos. But he also had inquiries to tattoo over self-harm scars. Some with severe scarring, those few we didn't even uh, put in the on the waiting list. We just booked them in right away, you know, because it does affect their lives quite a bit. And once we do the tattoos, you see the, the transformation with them, like, instantly. You know, especially the next time they come in, you know, they're wearing different clothing. How's it feel? It's a little stingy. Peace yeah. was surprised by the number of people who wanted self-harm scars covered up. He's tattooing more than a dozen people. It's a crappy world, right? It's, it's, uh, it's tough out there for a lot of people. Uh, so we just figured, I mean, it's easy. We love tattooing. So, you know, as long as we book our week up, you know, come in on a day off and do someone's scars. I mean, it's, you know, it's, it's not really work for us. For sure. Freeman already has a tattoo that hides more severe scarring. That includes words cut into her left thigh. This new one will hide the rest. It's something that's on me and I have to deal with it. So it's just a nice fresh start. <laughs> in Calgary, Crystal Adaris, City News.